First event is the men's two hundred freestyle is five. Taking fast with playing all his medal presentations. All night for you. Taking us right through to just after eight o'clock. Kirill Popov from Russia goes in lane one. In this men's 200 freestyle S5. Jonas Larsson from Denmark in two. James Scully from Ireland, already a medalist in the 100 freestyle. Can he double up with a 200 medal? Roman Adenov from Russia, the youngster, the 16 years of age. Swam a lifetime best in the heats to qualify fastest for the final. But this man, Andrew Mullen. Well, I think he's got a little more to give. And this man, Sebastian Rodriguez, the European record holder. Well, he's definitely holding back in the heats this morning. Comfortable qualification for a lot of the big names. Grebenic in lane seven for Croatia. And Jordi Godillo from Spain in lane number eight. So this is the men's S5, 200 meters freestyle. Number S1 to 10. Those are physical impairments. This is right in the middle of the physical impairment spectrum here. Sebastian Rodriguez from Spain. European record holder goes in lane six. Well, different start styles there. Rodriguez gets away well in lane number six. Been a bit off the boil, Paul, but uh, looking good so far in this race. He's the Paralympic silver medalist from London in an event which uh, is typically dominated by swimmers from around the world. Gold medalist is Daniel Diaz, the great Daniel Diaz of Brazil. The bronze went to Roy Perkins of the USA. Andrew Mullen going out with Rodriguez here. It'll be Rodriguez first to the turn. Two very different turning styles there. And Mullen does very, very well underwater to claw that ground out of Rodriguez. The shorter arms of Andrew Mullen, much, much greater turnover. Rodriguez, much greater lever length, able to really lock that hand in the water. Well, maybe he's been toying with the field a little bit to this point, Paul, because he looks in good shape here. Certainly was easing back in the heats today. So was Andrew Mullen, and we can see that these two now going away from the others in this field. James Scully and Roman Zadanov look like they are in a fight for the bronze medal position. But Andrew Mullen making up ground on these turns. We typically we've seen Sebastian Rodriguez go out fast in these 200 freestyle races and tried to hang on in the closing stages. That's a tactic he's used a number of times now. I'm sure the other teams will be aware of that, and it's a more considered race now for Sebastian Rodriguez, but he is considerably older than Andrew Mullen. We just wonder how much stamina that Sebastian Ru Rodriguez will have in the closing stages. Mullen still there. We'll see what happens at this turn. It's very, very close between the two. A real fight on here. Well, if Mullen can claw back the ground the way that he has on all the other turns, and he moves in front this time by quite some distance, by half the body length. Now, this is going to be about who can hold on down this final length of the 200 metres freestyle. There goes Mullen, you can see those stump arms of his, they come over, there's not a lot of fight for them in the water, and he's being cheered on by his teammates. High turnover of Andrew Mullen, that's Rodriguez, much slower turnover, Mullen's got the of him here, Paul, as they come into the final 15 metres. This will be a famous victory for Andrew Mullen if he can hold on against the European record holder. Andrew Mullen has swum this absolutely perfectly. It's going to be gold to Great Britain. Andrew Mullen will take the title. Andrew Mullen takes gold for Great Britain in 2.46.27. Rodriguez is the silver medalist for Spain and James Scully, the bronze for Ireland. And a celebration from Andrew Mullen. He held on to Sebastian Rodriguez. The turns were vital. And Mullen was the stronger in the last 50.
Well, in the end, it wasn't a great time for Rodriguez against his lifetime best, although he hasn't been near that European record since 2008 when he set it. The veteran competitor first to congratulate Andrew Mullen. Great sportsmanship down here at the swimming pool. And Andrew Mullen there in emphatic style. Loves a good celebration at the end, Paul. He does indeed. That's three gold medals now for Andrew Mullen. What a championship he is having. Never before has he been on the top spot in a major competition until he came here for these European Championships. That's three gold medals. And look at that. That last turn was absolutely superb from Andrew Mullen. And coming into the last five, he had a body length lead over Rodriguez. The Spaniard could not respond to Andrew Mullen. Well, as you say, Paul, this was a race that was all about the turns. Andrew Mullen so much better on the underwater section. Has the disadvantage with the arm stroke, but has that advantage with that leg kick that he's got, which he can deploy when he's in the underwater section. Here he comes into the finish again. He speeds up his stroke so that he can just whack that time pad and stop the clock. He looks around. That was good, Andrew Mullen. Yeah, here we go. Great sportsmanship on these two, as you said, Giles. All drivers. Well, this, the final turn, Rodriguez employs very much a grab turn, hasn't got any push off the wall. Mullen under the water there, and he pops up. Well, in distance, in distance gain, just like a body length and a half. Really, really superb. Well, it was a victory for Andrew Mullen of Great Britain, 246.27, just over a second ahead of Sebastian Rodriguez of Spain. Ireland's James Scully is the bronze medalist.